Welcome to Advanced Lightroom Processing, the most comprehensive course that focuses strictly on the power of raw processing within the Lightroom Develop module. What's up guys, my name is Pai Jirsa and I am so excited to bring you this course, Advanced Lightroom Processing. Why? Because, well, I am constantly seeing photographers taking images into Photoshop that don't need to be going into Photoshop. Photographers are underestimating and underutilizing the power of Lightroom's raw editing capabilities. In fact, they're going into Photoshop and doing things that take far more time inside of Photoshop via layers and masks and so forth, things that could be easily done in a matter of seconds within Lightroom. Now we are confident that this is the most comprehensive raw processing tutorial available for Lightroom and ACR. This course is just over 11 hours and it's focused heavily on portrait photography. But we also include several tutorials in the realm of commercial photography, on landscape photography, journalism, and so forth. Through our 70 start to finish edits, we have designed this course to not only cover all the stylistic effects that you can achieve in raw processing, but also situational raw processing. Now this course is a Lightroom develop module focused course, but a lot of people don't know when you're working inside of Photoshop or inside of Lightroom doing raw processing, you're actually using the exact same application. Inside of Photoshop, if you open a raw file, it opens Adobe Camera Raw, otherwise known as ACR. The thing is, ACR is the exact same thing as what's available to you inside of Lightroom, only in the Lightroom application, it's packaged as the Lightroom Develop Module. But they are one in the same in every respect, which means everything that you learn inside this course can be applied to Lightroom and Photoshop raw processing. In fact, the entire first chapter of this course is all situational raw processing. So for example, what do you do in mixed lighting situations when you have mixed lighting indoors or if you're shooting on a dance floor? What about when you're shooting outdoors in spotty, hard, midday lighting and you have no choice but to shoot journalistically? How do you develop to enhance overall dynamic range or to smooth skin when it comes to boudoir images? From there, we move on to chapter two and over 30 start to finish stylistic edits designed to teach you the ins and outs and capabilities of every raw processing function and feature. So from beautiful high contrast color images that retain fantastic skin tones, all the way through to creating fantastically gorgeous and dramatic HDR environmental portraits, to the oh so popular bright and airy sun-kissed Orange County look, all the way through to emulating film styles and so much more. On top of that, we're gonna show you the potential and power of Lightroom's local adjustments. In chapter three, we're gonna take everything that we have learned and we're gonna apply it to other genres of photography and teach you just how far you can take your images. In fact, we're even gonna show you how you can take landscape images captured out of a car from the side of a freeway into incredible works of art. So to learn more, be sure to check out the link below in the description or simply go to slrlounge.com forward slash store. My name is Pi and I'll see you all in the next video.